Hidden beneath the border of Switzerland and France lies one of humanity's greatest scientific creations, a 27-kilometer ring that s changing what we know about reality itself. It's called CERN, the European Organization for Nuclear Research. Some say it's a portal to other dimensions. Others say it's where the secrets of the universe are slowly being unlocked. But what is CERN, really? What does it do? And where is it going next? Let's dive deep into the heart of the world's largest scientific experiment. CERN was founded in 1954, right after World War II, when Europe wanted to rebuild not just its cities, but its scientific power. Its name comes from the French, Conseil Européen pour la Recherche Nucléaire, meaning European Council for Nuclear Research. But today, it's not about nuclear bombs or weapons. CERN is about pure science, exploring the smallest building blocks of the universe. If you could zoom in beyond atoms, past the protons and neutrons, you'd find a world of subatomic particles. These are the tiniest bits of matter, and they behave in ways that defy our common sense. CERN is where we study them. At the heart of CERN is a giant, the Large Hadron Collider, or LHC. It's a 27-kilometer ring-shaped tunnel, buried about 100 meters underground, stretching across the Swiss-French border near Geneva. Inside this ring, protons are accelerated to 99.999991% of the speed of light, that s 11,000 circuits around the ring every second. Then, those protons slam into each other, releasing bursts of energy so intense they mimic the conditions of the universe just after the Big Bang. Why? Because by recreating those moments, we can see what reality looked like at the very beginning. And maybe, discover the missing pieces of the cosmic puzzle. Each collision is recorded by massive detectors with names like Atlas, CMS, ALICE, and LHCB. They were not just machines. They have our digital eyes watching particles come into existence for the first time. In 2012, CERN made history when scientists announced the discovery of the Higgs boson, sometimes called the God Particle. It was the missing piece of the Standard Model, the theory that explains how everything in the universe gets its mass. Without the Higgs, matter wouldn't form. You, me, the Earth, none of it would exist. But CERN's contributions go even further. Antimatter experiments, understanding the mirror opposite of everything we know, proton therapy, medical applications that use particle beams to destroy cancer cells, and maybe the most unexpected of all, the birth of the internet. In 1989, CERN scientist Tim Berners-Lee invented the World Wide Web as a way for scientists around the world to share research instantly. So next time you go online, remember, it all started underground at CERN. With such power and mystery, CERN has become a magnet for wild theories. Some believe its particle collisions could open black holes, parallel universes, or tear open the fabric of space-time itself. CERN scientists say those fears are exaggerated. The energy produced is far too small to destroy the planet. But that doesn't stop the imagination. Because when you're literally recreating the conditions of the Big Bang, who's to say what you might find? The story isn't over. CERN's next phase is already in motion. An even more powerful machine called the Future Circular Collider, or FCC. It's planned to be 100 kilometers long, four times the size of the LHC, and will dive even deeper into the unknown. Its mission? To explore dark matter, dark energy, and the invisible forces that make up 95% of the universe. Things we know exist, but have never seen. This next generation of experiments could rewrite physics as we know it and maybe even reveal the hidden architecture of reality itself. CERN isn't just a lab. It's a gateway, not to another dimension, but to knowledge itself. It's where humanity stares into the fabric of the universe and dares to ask, what are we made of? And how far can we go? So the next time you look up at the night sky, remember, deep below the earth, thousands of scientists are smashing atoms together searching for the answers to everything. And somewhere, in that swirl of particles, might be the key to the future of reality itself. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this journey into the heart of science, don't forget to like, subscribe,
and hit that notification bell for more deep dives into the biggest questions of our universe. Etris 2 and 10.